SSM Health St. Mary's has some familiar faces back in their building. They're volunteers. 27 Sarah Massar donor has you covered this morning on how the hospital is bringing back these much needed volunteers safely. Nick and Rebecca, last half hour, we heard from a longtime volunteer who was grateful to be back in person. And the director of volunteer services tells me that most volunteers they've been able to bring back so far left at the opportunity to return and completed all necessary safety protocols quickly. For instance, all volunteers needed to get a COVID-19 vaccine and complete safety training. There are 750 volunteers total. As of April 1st, 117 adults were back and 36 more are committed to return starting May 1st. We have 153 volunteers who, without any doubt in their mind, without any hesitation, um, immediately responded to our request, offering them to come back, saying, yes, I am coming back and I want to come back. That 750 number is made up of both adults and college and high school students. I'm told those teens and young adults will end up being brought back at a later date. A note about how critical the staff says these volunteers are. I'm told that while a volunteer can never replace paid staff, staff still felt the loss of those in-person volunteers last year when they took on a few extra services that were usually completed by those volunteers.